dear aspirant uh, today we are going to discuss the one topic which is uh, coming in the every examination aap chahe wo ssc le lo aap chahe wo bank po le lo ya aap koi bhi other government exam le lo aapka ek topic aata hai question aapse poochta hai suppose it is given like this what will be the at the unit place so first thing we have to understand here कि यूनिट प्लेस का मतलब क्या होता है सपोज मैं आपसे कह रहा हूं एक नंबर दिया है मुझे 345। सो so, 345 नंबर में द फाइव इज एट द यूनिट प्लेस फोर इज एट द टेंथ प्लेस एंड थ्री इज एट द आई कैन से हंड्रेड प्लेस एंड सो ऑन सो एनी नंबर स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम द राइट हैंड साइड फर्स्ट डिजिट विल कॉल एज द यूनिट प्लेस नंबर सो बेसिकली हेयर वी आर गोइंग टू डील विद द इफ आई सॉल्व दिस एक्सप्रेशन what will be there at the unit place of this expression so basically we can solve this concept by the cyclicity concept and what is actually cyclicity concept we will see in the this video so <clears throat> suppose any number is given as we increase the power of that number suppose 2 so suppose 2 to power 1 is basically we can see is 2 then 2 square is basically 4 2 to power 3 is 8 and 2 to power 4 is 16 as soon as we will move to 2 to power 5 jaise hum 2 ki power 5 pe jayenge kya hoga 2 to power 5 is basically 32 so now you can see that the number at the the number at the unit place is start repeating itself or not because 2 was here and now again the 2 is start repeating itself similarly 2 to power 6 is basically we can say 64 so again you can see the number at the unit place is start repeating itself similarly 2 to power 7 is 128 and 2 to power 8 is 256 so now you can see continuously the number repeating itself again as soon as we will come to 2 to power 9 what will happen again again the number is start repeating and it's become 512 so now you can see after every fourth power after every fourth power the number at the, the number at the unit place is start repeating itself so this uh, this thing will continue okay that means after every fourth power 4 8 12 16 in this way the number is start repeating itself so we are saying that the cyclicity of 2 is called as the cyclicity of cyclicity of 2 is 4 so we have find out one number the cyclicity of 2 so how to find with the help of this the uh, like a unit digit place so we will see in the video firstly we are finding out the cyclicity of all the number so this is the cyclicity of 2 so we have seen that the cyclicity is 4 basically okay now then we will move to the next number next number is 3 next number is 3 so again we can see 3 to power 1 is 3 3 to power 2 is 9 3 to power 3 is 27 and 3 to power 4 is 81 as we move to the 3 to power 5 again 3 to power 5 is how much if you multiply 81 by 3 how much you will get 243 so again you can see the number at the unit place is start repeating itself then similarly 3 to power 6 again you will multiply 243 into 3 that is coming as 729 so now the again same trend is started that means now we can say that the cyclicity of 3 is how much again 4 so we got that the cyclicity of 2 is 4 similarly the cyclicity of 3 is also 4 <coughs> cyclicity means simply in this this term we can say after how many power the digit at the unit place is start repeating 
itself so in the 2 and in the 3 we have seen that there is start repeating itself after every fourth power that's why we are saying that the cyclicity of 2 and 3 is 4 now the next number is 4 itself the next number is 4 itself so again we will do the same process 4 to power 1 is 4 4 square is 16 then 4 cube is how much 16 into 4 again 64 so we can write it here then 4 to power 4 is how much you can multiply 64 into 4 that is 256 that means again we can say the number at the unit place is start repeating but here <coughs> not after 4 power but here after power 2 power so we can say that the cyclicity of number 4 is cyclicity of 4 is 2 okay similarly so now we are seeing that the cyclicity differ it's not like every digit have cyclicity of 4 we can see that the cyclicity of 2 and 3 is 4 but cyclicity of 4 is 2 only <coughs> similarly we will come to the next power and next power is 5 so 5 to power 1 is 5 then 5 square is 25 then 5 cube is 125 so you are seeing that the whatever power it is whatever power it is in any case what you are getting you are getting the 5 in the unit place so simply we can say that the number is start repeating after any one power so the cyclicity of number cyclicity of 5 is how much 1 so we are seeing that we are getting different different cyclicity according to the number similarly the next number is 6 so here you can see again the same concept as you are increasing the power the number at the unit place is not changing so that means again we can say the cyclicity of 6 is 1 cyclicity of 6 is 1 now come to the next thing next thing is the 7 the next number is the 7 ok now 7 to power 1 is 7 7 square means 7 into 7 so if you multiply both the number how much you will get you will get 49 okay then 7 cube is 7 cube means 7 square multiply by 7 that means 49 multiply by 7 how much you will get 7 ninja 63 you will get 3 here then 6 then 7 4 ja, 28 plus 6 how much it is 343 so that means 7 cube is 343 now 7 to power 4 again multiply 343 multiply by 7 240 now soon as you will come to the 7 to power 5 7 to power 5 become what again multiply this number by 7 16807 <coughs> so now you can see that the number at the unit place start repeating itself that means once repetition is start it will go continuous that means we can say that the cyclicity of number 7 is again 4 so we have got three number right now 2 3 and 7 which has cyclicity of 4 now the next number is 8 the next number is 8 so let's find out the cyclicity of 8 so 8 to power 1 is 8 8 square is then again as soon as you will do the 8 cube 8 cube means what 64 multiply by 8 you will get 
500 then 8 to power 4 that means again you can multiply by 8 4 0 8 to power 4 is 4 0 9 6 again 8 to power 5 8 to power 5 is again you will multiply this number by 8 how much you will get 3 2 7 6 8 3 2 7 6 8 now you can see at the unit place start repeating itself. So, again we can say the cyclicity of 8 is how much 4. So, the next number which we have 9, the next number which we have is 9. So, we can find out now the cyclicity of 9. So, cyclicity of 9 again 9 square is 81 then 9 cube you can again multiply 81 into 9 that is equal to 729. So, now you can see that the number start again repeating at the unit place. So, we can say that the cyclicity of 9 is how much 2. So, now we can make a table. Now we can say number is 2, 3, then 7 and 8. These numbers are there which have cyclicity of 4. Cyclicity is 4. Now the other number like 4, then 9, cyclicity of 2. And the other number like 5, 6, now they have cyclicity of 1. So, this is the concept of cyclicity which we have seen till now. Now, question arise with the help of this cyclicity, how we can find out the what will be there at the unit place. So, this is the concept of cyclicity. Now, in the next video, we will see how with the help of this cyclicity concept, we will find out what will be there at the unit place. So, keep watching our space and we will post the next video shortly.